I love all bitches. Imagine uploading RuneCrafted content for 50 plus thousand people to watch. Oh, I hope you guys are enjoying. 91 mining. Burnt out for PUBG, by the way. <laughs> 88. I'm so sorry to disappoint you guys. This is not a RuneCrafting level up. This is actually a farming level up. Oh man, quick change of pace, eh? Every time I look at this farming level, I just think, like, how insane is this? This is all done from Herb Runs, which was all gained from Slayer, because I'm an Iron Man. Get the 60 stacks. Like, everything. I'm just, ooh, mm, ow. 68 herbs from the one farmer. Let me show you guys the current uh, Herb tab. Uh, look at the seeds, by the way. Look at, oh, just Aventos and Toad Flax left and, like, two torsos. Um... Herbs, bam! Oh my, it's growing every day, like my dick when your mom's over. In the case you guys are wondering, these are the dwarfs I have. Plant of Dimes, eh, like 2,500 there or some shit, so... That's so, I can't wait to use all these. It's gonna be so good. Those guans, I'm never using those. But yeah, by tomorrow I will have no more seeds mine. Just the Toad Flax, so I'm gonna be doing those for a little while, and uh, should be back to Slayer in about a week. Reminder to do your bone meal every day on your Iron Man, by the way. Almost at a thousand again. Holy shit, beast. Imagine collecting 250s a day because you're too pussy to do Zora. Well, hello, my name's Alkian, and I like the runecraft in my spare time. Clearly, I got a lot of spare time. 89. I will be here for two more levels, and then we don't even have to boost for the Karemja Diary. And then we're off to get 90 crafting. And I obviously uh, did a little bit of crafting after. Ooh, 73k to level. What are the chances? <laughs> But I did about 300k crafting XP tonight, testing out the uh, make all stuff. I haven't really done anything with it yet. Um, and it was pretty cool. So, yeah, I mean, technically I'm 73k XP till I can get a Fury, but imagine boosting, bro. Don't poison me. Uh, we're good. No, ah, we're good. So, just a small change of pace, and I always merely pray here in case I DC, which I almost did before. Uh, but doing some of these lovely fire orbs. Look at that XP drop, isn't that beautiful? <laughs> so I do get this question asked a lot because I think when Iron Man kind of first started, everyone made air orbs and battle staffs, and that's basically how you'd make your money on an Iron Man back when it kind of came out. As you guys have seen my Slayer tab, 40 mil plus cash and like 10 or 20 mil put into skills and along that, so it'd be like 60 mil cash if you did just 99 Slayer. Uh, you make 100 mil from 99 runecrafting now. Uh, it used to make like nothing basically. And this makes it so you don't have to do this method here anymore. If there wasn't charter ships, this would be by far the best method, and every Iron Man would be basically filthy rich, but uh, the charter ships are better. Um, but one thing to keep in mind, actually, is until 87 crafting, charter ships are not much better than this here. Especially if you got 77 RC uh, from doing ZMI, you'll have a lot of Cosmics like I do. Um, I've probably had over 12,000 Cosmics, mostly just from ZMI. But doing this method here, I think is around 500 orbs per hour, and then, uh, yeah, it's like 2k profit per orb, or per orb, basically, so, um, this is, it's not bad to do this until 87, once you're 87, you want to do the dork orbs, uh, at the charter ships, that's like almost 100k an hour, I believe, and this comes nowhere near that, but currently, I'm just making, like, you know, tiny bit of these things here. Now, if you don't like doing charter ships, uh, even though it's kind of AFK now with the make all option, then I guess this would be the second best option, potentially. So there, uh, there is that. I guess I will not be doing uh, this method to 99. I think I'm gonna get poisoned in the next one here. Is it? I yeah, there it is. Oh, I was about to go down anyways. But uh, yeah, that's. I mean, you can do it a little bit faster like this. And with the with the space bar thing now, it's this is like R3, bro. Like look at this shit. Oh man. Anyways, I will see you guys in the bits probably uh, in about how many hours? Ugh. Like a little like 11 hours or so. I'll be 90 room crafting and I should be able to get 85 crafting actually very soon as well So sweet. Oh, I missed it. But look at the chat box Look at that zoom in by the way. Ooh, look at that zoom. Oh back zoom zoom back in. Oh shit 85 crafting though, man. Oh, right. This is the level you can make a fury if you're a booster. Pfft, imagine boosting This has taken me so many hours. Oh shit, look at Oh, oh no. Are we ready? Yes, we are. Oh. 
Moment of silence. Ooh, soul runes. I forgot about those things. I'm not going to be making those in case you're wondering because not really worth it. So I do believe this guy can boost your rune crafting by two or decrease it by two, but I'm not 100% sure. Oh yeah, so there it is right there. Plus two boost. Now I will be giving 91 anyways, but I just wanted to actually test that out because I've never ever heard of that guy boosting two rune crafting for you. So you can either do minus two or plus two, so... If you don't want to fuck around with stews, that's an easy way to get it. Shit, I said the F word. If you don't want to fuck around with stews, that's an easy way to get it. This should be the diary complete. Bam. All the way. All the crumjas. All the crumjas. Look at that. Ah. Alright, I, I think it's this person that does it. I'm not, I'm not too sure. Is it you? Yeah. Oh, the lamp though. I'm not sure this how much experience one is. I know the original... Uh, diary is Karamjan. I don't think it's actually 50k, but it might be because this is an elite one. Yeah, an elite was added later on. Originally, it was just Karamja hard way back in the day. So now we can teleport strictly to Duradel if we want to do Slayer here or not. So it's the same thing as like the Eternal Slayer gem thing that I have, so eh, we'll see. I will give you guys a quick little showdown though of these lovely blood runes. Take a look at this, mate. <gasps> oh my goony. So, what the hell is next? I know I wanted to get 91 RC, but I didn't want to ruin the perfect looking 90 stat, to be completely honest with you. Sure, I will return in the future, but uh, the next thing I think I will be doing is probably the 90 crafting grind. I forgot I'm even I wanted to get 87 first, but I think I'll just suffer through an extra two hours or so of doing the charter ships and just get it to 87 and go all the way to 90 with uh, crafting. So no boosting, hopefully. I mean, if there's like a plus one or two boosts I can find that's really easy to get, why not? But I still want to get that to 90 anyway because it looks sexy. This is going to be 2 million crafting XP. That's going to take about 40, uh, no, nah, less than 40, probably 30 hours, something like that. I'm not even too sure what the rates are, honestly. So I'll see you guys with, uh, oh God, it's going to be another one of those long grinds. This is going to be faster than room crafting. The room crafting was like, what, 38K an hour? Probably 35, including all the herb runs. So uh, I'm not sure if I'll actually be doing herb runs while I do charter ships because you you can stall the herbs basically for like 10 hours straight. If you do charter ships for 10 hours, you can have herbs that take you over 10 hours to grow. But after that, who knows where we're gonna go? I might go back to do some barrows, try to get the more Tanya diary. We'll see. I, I want to finish more of these diaries, but just not yet. It's too early. All right, no more rambling. Let's get some shit done, boys. Ah, that was a long grind. One more level. So, I believe I've decided that the rest of this crafting XP from here on, I will probably actually be finishing through some battle staffs, and uh, as well as probably going back to runecrafting, actually. I'll probably do like four or five days of runecrafting, so... Uh, yeah, I think I got like 50k crafting a day or some crap from doing that, so... Not too bad, but uh, yeah, this method is extremely fun. Gonna be even better once I get the uh, 87, and uh, gonna have to start dropping items every time I do it, though, which is the only unfortunate part. But um, anyways, yeah, and I switched back to Old School Buddy for this reason right here, so I can quick hop while I am doing that spell. Uh, otherwise, you can't really do it, so not sure if it's considered really OP or not, but I wish you could just do that on any client. Sure is nice to be fashion scapey though, man. Ah, look at that. It's gonna be a fury on this bitch soon. And then hopefully in the future, the little lovely uh, Abyssal Slayer Helm. All right, let's go. <laughs> Bass. Oh shit. This is the wrong account. Content, by the way. If I press spacebar, it's gonna show double nature runes. This used to be an achievement. Now it's a joke. Ah, it's crazy how much the game changes, man. I remember when I first got that back in the first year this game came out, and ah, oh. ah, oh. we got a moment of silence. Okay, okay, one minute moment. Let's. Oh. Ooh, shit. I was like, I basically got a fucking boner. Anyways, back to AFK. Ah, uh, feels good. All that progress we made today. Whew. Well, I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. Put a whole bunch more time into it. Ooh, nah, I don't see Mega Man that shit. Where's that? Ah, yeah, seeds. At the end of every video, we do a little spoiler for the next video. I'm gonna do a rotation of my kit. Wait a minute, I need to pot up. Wait a minute. I've been editing this video, but oh, I didn't even need to rotate it. Look, what am I wearing? 
<laughs> Spoiler piece of shit. Hey, if you make it to a 10 plus minute video, you're basically a champion. Unless you use ad block, then you're kind of a champion. <laughs> what ad? So, next video, obviously, you'll be getting any crafting. Oops, spoiler. And then uh, I'm going to show you guys as well my Slayer tab. Probably make a video on that because I, I think it's good to do that. So, that'll be next. And uh, yeah, see you guys hopefully in a few, few days, maybe. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed today's video, man. I'm not going to do an awkward ending, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. See you guys next time. Link in the description. That you fucked up. Oop, no, don't say that F word, man. Link on the screen if you want to watch the last episode of the Hardcore Anime Series, by the way.